Hello there, my name is Monib Siddiqui and welcome to CSCI 2020 conference. This presentation is about improved image semantic segmentation based on cascade data augmentation. The following outlines will be introduced. We'll have an introduction on semantic segmentation, then we'll go for literature review, the methodology of this paper will be introduced, the experiments that we conducted, including the data sets that we used, and we will have a conclusion and future work. Image semantic segmentation, which refers to pixel-wise classification of an image, is a vital topic in computer vision. It provides a comprehensive scenery description of the given image, including <clears throat> the information of object category, location, and shape. Applications of image semantic segmentation range from scene understanding to self-driving cars, medical image analysis, and robot vision. In particular, we want to develop an algorithm that will be able to segment an input image into each pixel of an image into classified output. Challenges. There are three main challenges for image semantic segmentation. Dense pixel prediction of huge number of objects in an image. As we know that semantic segmentation refers to pixel-wise classification of an image. So there are an a lot of classes inside one image, and that is very challenging. Second, small size of datasets for training of deep learning algorithms. And third, data augmentation for semantic segmentation. There are available data augmentation for image classification, but there is less data augmentation strategy for image semantic segmentation. Our contribution in this research are as follow. We conduct a comprehensive literature review on data augmentation for image semantic segmentation and report the results of recent advances in this area. We hope that this literature review become a good source of information for data augmentation for semantic segmentation. Further, we propose a novel data augmentation strategy for image semantic segmentation by utilizing the basic image processing techniques. The proposed method boosts the performance of baseline networks for semantic segmentation in terms of pixel accuracy and mean intersection over union. And in comparison with state-of-the-art methods, our approach achieves encouraging results. Data augmentation literature review this units advances the performance of computer vision tests to a soaring high. However, these algorithms require a huge amount of data in order to perform well on the task at hand. Augmentation for image classification is data set specific, thus it's not transferable to other domains such as semantic segmentation. In one line of research, Shang-Ting present the pixel level data augmentation using GAN in order to improve the performance of semantic segmentation networks for specific classes. Their, their network perform well by generating extra label semantic classes. Methodology. We reformulate the problem of random augmentation operation into a cascade data augmentation. We further incorporate a probability and magnitude parameters for the augmentation operations. Combining these effective geometric operations, photometric operations in a sequential order by using the magnitude of operation, information of the operations provide us unique and diverse data. As we can see, the images have been segmented from one simple image, just normal brightness, to quite dark and very bright images. This helped network learn different patterns about the network, uh, about the images.
experiments. We use Pascal context dataset in order to, um, to prove the effectiveness of our proposed method. Pascal context dataset is a fully annotated images. It contains around 5,000 training data, 5,000 uh, validation data, and the total number of classes are 60. Here is an example of Pascal context dataset. Visual results. We compare the effectiveness of our method with the baseline with other baseline networks. As it can be seen, the proposed method yield better result in comparison to the baseline model. In the first row, the baseline model produces some noise in the airport, whereas our method overcome this issue. We attribute this robust performance of the network to the huge and diverse input images produced by the proposed cascade augmentation strategy. In the second augmentation, in the second and third row, our method corrects the error of the baseline method by removing the noise in the predicted image. These visual results validate the effectiveness of the proposed method. We further report quantitative results on Pascal context dataset. We implement cascade data augmentation using several recent Mm, semantic segmentation methods. For example, as it can be seen in Table 1, fast FCN with ResNet Backbone 101 achieves a pixel accuracy of uh, mean intersection over union accuracy of 53.1% without uh, CDA. However, by implementing CDA with the same default setting of fast FCN, we the, the performance of the network improves to 53.81%. This, this is almost 0.7% gain over the baseline network. Conclusion and future work. In this research, we conducted a comprehensive study on data augmentation for image semantic segmentation. The accepted data augmentation for semantic segmentation is random flipping and cropping. We formulated these, these uh, random augmentation into a sequential ordered augmentation and introduced a novel cascade data augmentation. CDA combines effective geometric operation with photometric ones to extend the size of data. Incorporating CD into modern CNN architecture adds significant gain to the performance of the network. We hope that this research ends up effective for the research community. Transferring CDA for semantic, from semantic segmentation into object detection is another area to harvest research in. Thanks for your attentions. Would you have any questions? Please contact me by email. Thank you.